it's just uh, the mindset of the team now, but I guess even at that moment when you guys were down early in the game, the crowd was obviously pretty hostile and a lot of blue in the crowd. Just, I mean, is that about as, as much as you remember sort of being tested and, and keeping your spirit up as, as in the years you've been here? It's, it's definitely, it's definitely, if not the first, yeah. I mean, yes, it was, we were absolutely tested right off the bat. You know, you, you, you put yourself in a hole like that. Um, that is not something in this league that's easy to crawl out of. Um, but you know what, I, I think we did do a good job of fighting, scratching, clawing, and doing everything we could to, to get back into that game. I have to eyes at this, but the fact that you guys keep having a far stretch to get out of these self inflicted wounds and hole, how it's up to you. Well, it is. Um, and, you know, unfortunately, we haven't been able to switch it around yet um, and, and start fast, start hot. Um, and it's something we have to keep trying to figure out. Um, I wish I could pinpoint it, but I, I don't know exactly what it is. Um, but we just have to come out and play better than we have to start. And how do you, as a office line position group, view like Derek's multiple injuries this year? Do you guys, do you guys take that personally, or is it just like kind of just this is option? Uh, I mean, I think we definitely take it personally. Um, that's nothing, you know, we take pride in keeping the quarterback clean, keeping him healthy. So if he's getting hit back there, he's getting injured, you know, ultimately, that falls on us. It's our job to protect him. So, yeah, I do, I do think we take that personally. Did you notice the boots that they were acting yesterday? And so, kind of, how does that make you feel like you did that? Um, I noticed a little bit. Um, listen, the fans are frustrated. We're frustrated. Everyone's frustrated. Um, and like I said, we have to do everything in our power to play better football, play better football early on and start winning these games. So I think there's frustration all around and um, we just, have, we, we got to improve. If, if Jameis, if Harmon is not on the game, does it start like Jameis is playing? Especially with what you've seen, from him coming away from games, practice, whatever, I count on you that, um, that he'll be able to do this. You know, I think we have a ton of confidence in Jameis. We definitely do. Um, he's played quarterback for a while now. Um, you know, he's a great leader. He prepares right. Um, you know, he's a great guy to have in that huddle. So we have his back. Um, you know, I, I know he's going to be prepared and, and ready for if he does have to play. Is it different for a team with the starting quarterback as well? You know, you hear about next man up all the time, but knowing like, um, I, you know, I don't know how other guys view it. Um, for me personally, I speak for myself. Um, I don't view it differently. Um, we each have a job to do, and I think we're all pretty focused on what our job is. Um, you know, so I think having someone else come in there is, is for me anyway, I don't notice a big change. I know the mentality is always go one or go to Washington or Washington or whatever happened in the last game or last week, but how much is the other side of time is running out to creep into the conversation? Well, it absolutely is. Um, we're getting to crunch time here. Um, you know, we have to win these games down the stretch here. You know, there is no more. Uh, we lost this one, but, you know, we still got some games left. You know, it, it really is the end of the season here, so – um, yeah, we got to start winning games. Is it when, when you guys have had to kind of play from behind as often as you have this year, is that taking you out of like what, what you would you know, spend the whole week game planning for? Or, um, or do you feel like, like yesterday it happened so early that you're able to pretty much just run? Yeah, I think it, I think it can, um, you know, especially if you're not able to put any points up early. Um, you know, yesterday I think. We were able to get it going, and we were able to stick to our game plan a little bit more, um, you know. But it, it definitely can kind of take you out of the game plan and and force you into, you know, a lot more passing situations where you're you, you know you're trying to get back quickly. Um, so it can, yes.
Michael Thomas had a lot of unique tweets yesterday, and then of course the social media account goes down. Did y'all have any direct conversations with him about it? No, I haven't. Um, I don't have Twitter, so. I don't know. Yeah, Instagram. I, I don't use social media too much, though, so I'm not sure. Thank you. All right.